well hello 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 and welcome back to creative stuff in this video we are going to learn to how to control mul multiple pixel led strings using this tiny super cheap controller so this is the controller that we are going to test as the look of it you can tell that this is cheap so is its quality the soldering of the input and output pins were just bad and they ripped apart even before i could make the video so i had to open it and resolder the pins and now it's working fine to make it work with pixel leds you won't be needing any external power supply this controller can power and control up to 100 pixel leds connecting it to the pixel led string is very easy just connect the female connector of the controller with the male connector of the pixel string now connect the two pin plug of the controller to an ac socket as you can see it has multiple function loaded in it to add another string just connect output of the first string to the input of the second string Let's see what happens if we connect another string to it. As you can see, the third string doesn't light up. So, we can't connect more than 100 LEDs in series. But, we can use parallel connection to add more strings. To do that, I'll be using this 5V 20A power supply. connected all the positive terminals of the led strings together and did the same with the negative terminals then connected the common positive and negative wires to the smps positive and com port respectively now to power up the controller we won't be using ac power supply just connected positive and negative wires to the smps 5 volt and com port respectively here i have divided four of the strings into two parts the first part will have 100 leds and so to the second part you can use each led string individually too connected these female connectors to the input side of the first and third string so that i won't have to cut the wires to connect data wire then connected data wires of the first string third string and the controller together
then connected output pin of the first string to input pin of the second string to make a pair and did the same with the third and the fourth string. Then connected the SMPs to the main supply. And as you can see, we are able to control more than 100 LEDs using this tiny super chip controller. Hope you have enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, then please do follow my socials to get more such videos. That's it for today guys. See you in the next one.